do you owe? About a hundred grand. Is there a casino in town? Uh, I'm, I'm looking for my daughter. You got a photo? No, I don't have a photo. You don't carry a photo of your daughter? Are you judging me, kid? Let her ride. Oh! They just left. One positive about tracking degenerate gamblers. The Canadian Not Film Fest kicks off later this week, and besides showing a ton of great homegrown films, like the one we're watching now, Borealis, it also allows filmmakers to hone their skills. Joining me this morning with more is actor and screenwriter Jonas Chernick and director Warren Sonoto. Welcome. Hi. Hi. Thanks for Good having morning. us. Thanks for Good coming morning. so early. But we're here to talk about this amazing... The Canadian Film Fest. There, yes. <laughs> there you go. Oh. So, Warren, tell us a little bit about um, the master class. I mean, you're also moderating it. Yeah, one of the great things about the Film Fest that uh, Bern Euler, the festival director, always wanted to do was start the Film Fest off with a bang. Right. So every every year we start with a master class, but not just any master class. It's an intense, full day, um, no-holds-barred sort of investigation of the film world. This year it's the art of directing uh, actors and <laughs> Jonas is one of the actors that will be participating in the master class that's right um, and it's star-studded I mean it's six veteran veteran DGC directors and um, I think now nine or nine or ten uh, actor actors and for the entire day from 10 a.m. to 4 30 they're going to wow. be showing their stuff on Wednesday. Will there be lunch tool? served? There'll be uh, Batondo's Pizza, oh, which good. is right across the street from the Monarch. Good, because so, so you're nice in Toronto, you know yeah. what I'm talking about. Yes. Because I'll get hungry. I get hungry acting. Right. Um, yeah, you work up an appetite. Yes. So as an actor, yeah. um, tell us what makes for a great director. What do you um, look for? Well, there's a lot of there's a lot of different qualities. <laughs> Mostly, uh, he uh, embodies them. I think you want a uh, director who knows what he wants. That's always helpful. But also, or she, or she yep. of right. course, because yes. yep. many wonderful Thanks directors, of course, no, yeah. for sure, are women. And also, uh, but who has an openness to collaboration? Because right. I don't think as an actor you don't want to be looked at as a puppet. You want to be able to have a, a voice. And mm -hmm. so I think it's a combination of knowing what they want and also being open to collaborating. So, are, do you find that actors, directors? Are or a little, um, maybe have an upper hand? Yeah, I mean, I Just like working with actors, directors, and actor, director, of course, being a director that really understands actors right. and likes to communicate with actors. That's more fun uh, and for the actor. You work with two great ones, uh, Jeremy Lalonde and uh, Sean, Sean Gary. Gary. Yeah, both of, both of them have films Our in this festival. Acting di uh, directors, uh, yeah. actors, directors. They're actors, yeah. directors. Well, yeah. What do you think makes for a really great director, uh, as well, one yourself? Well, <laughs> You know, I, I think the, the I think he hits the, the the nail on the head of you. You got to be a good listener, and you got to have your actors back. I mean, our job is only to get the best performance out of the actor right. on the floor. That's all we're supposed to do. Mm -hmm. It's like being a baseball manager and getting the best performance out of a player. I love baseball. That's analogies. a no. Oh, are you excited? Okay, well, are you excited are, about yeah, the Jays coming. coming in 10 uh, days? Not as excited as I am about the Canadian <laughs> Film Fest starting <laughs> up on Wednesday. <laughs> uh, but, uh, yeah, the master class, when we, when we uh, do it, it's going to explore the relationship between uh, directors and the actors and in a very real way. We're going to have one director direct another director's scene Oh wow! with a new set of actors that is cool. and then the original director will present their scene the way they shot it and there's going to be a post-mortem and discussion of why they chose those decisions. And what an amazing uh, thing to participate in and be a part yeah. of. I mean it's already sold out you said, right? Well we just sold out last night <laughs> okay. but because we're doing this plug on breakfast television I talked with Byrne and we decided to open up 10 more spots. Amazing. That's so, crazy. Um, it's, it's That's going so to be good. very intense and very um, uh, busy but at the same time it's Probably one of the best experiences you can get in the independent and uh, lunch. cinema. We'll be yes, at, uh, <laughs> and lunch. in and Toronto. Uh, Jonas, yeah. you're in the opening night film as well as Borealis, in which you wrote and star in. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about Borealis, which is doing sure. so well, right? Oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah. we're doing great. Uh, it's a it's a father daughter okay, road so trip basically. I play a single dad with a teenage daughter who's losing her vision. Yeah. And I'm not a very good father, so I decide to give her something before she goes blind. I want to take her up to northern Manitoba to show her the most beautiful thing I've ever seen in my life, the Northern Lights, before she goes blind. And there's bad guys chasing us because I owe a lot of money. Um, so, it's a, but it's a, so it's a coming of age it's drama. You're a complicated comedy. character. And at the same time, it's a beautiful film. It's, oh, it's, it's a, a wonderful character study. And uh, you got to stay for the ending because it just, it just hits you. It, it, the ending is, just crushes your, your heart. And we have Kevin so Pollack from The Usual Suspects yeah. and Joey King, up and coming, big teen star. 
So it's uh, it's been a lot of fun. Yeah. And it's busy. You're promoting it. I'm promoting right. it. Yeah, we're Let's opening it across right the country after the festival. Yeah. We open across the country on April 8th here in Toronto, and then Winnipeg and Ottawa we roll so out. Canadians, please go see Canadian movies. <laughs> yes. And there you have it. We'll leave it at that. Thank you so much, you guys, you. and congratulations. Thank you so much. So far. Can you see the CFF? Um, we are now.